Hello, welcome to Spell Video 5. <clears throat> um, well this is my banishing spell that I wrote. Um, the purpose originally for this banishing spell was, well, I'll explain. My cousin, he was probably my cousin, I call him Ron, but that's another story. He believed inside of him was living this entity called Orion. And it, he, to him, it is what caused him to do things that annoyed the piss out of me and everyone else. Um, it came to the point where I actually got so erratic that it came to the, it just got so bad that he was just doing things that just annoyed the living crap out of me and Eric, the other member of our coven. So we decided to put a stop to it. So the idea was this: banish it. So, I read up on some banishing spells, and I came up across a couple. Um, at the time I was exercising my own ability to write my own spells, I was so proud of myself when I wrote one. Um, so I decided to take some aspects of several different banishing spells, I write my own, and take some things and create one. Well, I came up with, well, what I'm about to read to you. Um... I will tell you when you can insert, like, you can use this again for any, actually, any number of things, really, um, but you can just replace the names in that. Um, here it is. Also, I will be reading this as we wrote, read it for when we banished him. Also, um, for this, um, spell, we used a, you only need, like, a coffee can or something that's got a lid on it. Um, I used a big coffee can, and on the sides of the coffee can, I drew four runes. Um, I will put pictures of them after the at the end of the video for the credits. That way, you can know what they look like. Um, if I remember right, one means banishing, one means protection, basically protecting you from what you're banishing. 